stated that the current water crisis is a crisis of water governance. That means that many of the water challenges that we face today cannot be solved by technical means only, but call for new approaches of managing and governing water. So how can we best craft solutions and make decisions on water that are not only environmentally sustainable and technically feasible, but also just and fair, meaning that take these different interests and needs into account? And how can we make sure that it's not only the voices of the most powerful actors that are heard, but also those of the more marginalized and poor ones? As we say in Hindi that Jal hi jivan hai, that means water is life and it's true in so many ways. There is so much to learn and to explore so I decided to channel my desire in this specific stream. I have a passion in seeing people's lives transformed to take people out of poverty. Some people do not have enough food so that's why I had this drive to come to IHE to study land and water development because it goes well in feeding the world. The best thing about Tai Chi is the cultural diversity and, and the people diversity and the knowledge diversity and different approaches and different solutions to a set of problems. Here people come from across the world and from different backgrounds. Everybody looks at water with a different views. We don't come here just to study water or to study the technical stuff. We come here to learn from each other in an interactive way. That positive energy, that, that willingness to put that on the table in an everyday life, in an everyday classroom, it's, it's fulfilling. I never imagined I could meet so many people from different backgrounds and I could make so many friends. It's amazing. <laughs>